brighter blue actually started out as brighter shade of blue. When it says, you know, the sky is a brighter blue, it used to be the sky is a brighter shade of blue, just like the end, um, the tag. And then uh, we were working on it in the studio and Rich Jacks was in there and he was like, what if you shortened it? And we tried that and we liked it. It's a little less predictable. And so it became brighter blue. The song came from feeling really, really down and really blue and sad, depressed, and like in a dark place. People saying, you know, oh, well, you, you seem like you're doing better. And it's like, okay, I guess I am, but I'm still blue. I'm just a little bit of a brighter shade of blue. It was also sort of inspired by a song by Gregory Allen Isaacoff called All Shades of Blue. I was listening to that and thinking about that concept and decided to write my version. I wrote it with Garrison Starr. She's, she's so good at listening to what I'm saying and just sort of like being like, well, let's just say that in the song. So that's why the song starts out, you know that feeling? It's very conversational. There's, there's a lot of imagery and sort of metaphor and like when the sun hasn't come up yet, but you just start to notice the sky turning from night black to that deep indigo. And then it starts just getting lighter before the sun rises. And the second uh, chorus talks about I'm still underground with the light seeping through. And that was actually based on a tunnel that I went through in Italy that is miles long. It was intense. It goes through these mountains and you couldn't see the light at the end of the tunnel because it curved. But at, towards the end, after we'd been in this tunnel for at least 20 minutes, the light started having a different quality of daylight, but that was bouncing off walls and coming to us. It wasn't direct yet, but it was just changing the, the shade of the light. And that's what that lyric is about. Still underground with the light seeping through and the walls turn a brighter shade of blue. There's a line that says, it's hard to have faith when there's nothing to hold and the stories you told don't come true. It's hard to have faith in something that isn't happening. Like what someone's saying isn't what's what you're experiencing or the fantasies that you had or the things that you thought were going to happen don't happen, the stories you told yourself. And also on, on the flip side, stories that you tell yourself, negative stories don't come true, which can be part of the brighter shade. I hope that it's relatable and makes people feel a little bit better in that place. That it's okay to feel blue and it's okay to be on your journey of, of healing and processing whatever may be making you feel that way and to embrace even the little bits of light that come in.